think we roll, throw your hands up. People outside up in your eyes, turn this damn up. My size are legendary. The hottest shit this century is live wire. She's in the building and it's Woo Wednesday. It's Woo Wednesday. There she goes. What's good? We can hear you testing, testing, one, two, three. May Jackson, what's up, girl? How you doing? <laughs> doing good. How you out there? How you out there in the east? I'm going, I'm doing good, man. I'm in the south, actually. I'm in or I'm in Florida right now. Uh -huh. Oh, my favorite place in the whole wide world, Florida. You I love Florida, me too. Love it. I love it. I love it. I'm coming back really, really soon. So we're gonna definitely have to touch bases when I get out there. Oh yes, you gotta come party down south style. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? I love it. I love Florida. That's my place. That's my state. Love California too, you know, California my home. But uh I'd rather be fishing. <laughs> I refuse to accept the view that mankind is so tragically bound to the starless midnight of racism and war. And the bright daybreak of peace and brotherhood can never become a reality. Success rising, you was able to taste. Ain't nobody taking your place. Sorry that you had to go that way. Tell God, keep me a space. For his glory, I'ma sing it today. My father died in a similar way. Can't express difficulty and decision I made. Keep reminiscing all the things he would say. Master my mind, master ceremonies, give testimonies. No rat, no phony, stick to a story. Rest in peace, Bobby. Kiss her song for me. Yeah. The, the crowd start going crazy when I play Wink. Uh huh. Yeah, wink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You played Wink? Oh, wow, you found Wink. <laughs> yeah. I, was I was digging in there. Uh-huh. Doing yeah. my research. Yeah, what's, what's, wow, the thank you. what's the science behind the Wink? Wow, Wink, I wrote that, what, eight years ago? <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. I put that out a long time ago. Give him a little wink, right? Yeah, so it yeah. was just like, um, okay. you know, a kind of meet and greet type of thing. You know how when you meet somebody and they sexy or you like them and you kind of already role played in your mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so that's what wink is about. <laughs> okay. So when you see him get that little. Yeah, that's dope. Yeah. That's dope. Who was the producer on it? <laughs> That was Mr. Marlon Penn. Shout out to Marlon Penn. Um, I met them th in Brooklyn. So they was out in Brooklyn and we was working a little bit with Hugh Hustler Music back in the day, back back in that time. Okay. Um, that was when I first started, um, when I first started recording, being a recording artist and not just, you know, a songwriter in the house. Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So did you start off as a songwriter first before you actually started recording on your own? Yes. So I've been writing since I was a little girl. I always kept journals, wrote poems, wrote bars, just random songs and things like that. I always wrote, but I grew up in a music making family. My father was a singer. I have cousins who are singers. It's, it's just in our blood, um, you know, so it was always about music in the house. You know, so the, was, the background for music uh, comes from church. Yeah, I, I grew up in church. Uh, I grew up Pentecostal. I'm Puerto Rican, um, and my parents raised me in a Pentecostal church. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I hear you. Yes. Yes. So, what are we doing these days? Oh, I got so much going on. Uh huh. Got so much going on. I'm a one woman army over here. Oh, I um, just started Royal Stars Entertainment. Okay. Uh, so it is uh, event planning and independent artist consultation. Nice. Uh, it's your vision is my pleasure. So that's my motto. Okay, your <laughs> vision is to do events with nonprofit organizations with, you know, I want to help the youth. I want to help, um, you know, people who are running campaigns that are trying to do something for 
the homeless, the ex-felons. Um, I just partnered with Melissa Myers here in Orlando. Shout out to Melissa Myers. I joined her campaign. Um, she's running for state representative in Orlando for District oh, 45. Nice. Okay. And we're going to help her raise the money she needs uh, to get in that seat and to help our people out here, you know, ex-felons that can't get jobs, can't get housing, um, you know, people that are hungry and they're not, you know, we, we live in America, nobody should be hungry. Uh, right. So yes. I, I started that movement with them, um, besides, you know, and I met her doing my business. Okay. Not a day go by or a second in time You pee and poppy not on my mind The pain still shows in my eyes Poured out some Henny, we ain't drinking no beers You lived up to all your desires and fears Son, brother turned husband, a father who cared Bet you holding mama up there Kisses and hugs, no drama up there Rest up, soldier, you were living us here We won't ever forget I refuse to accept the cynical notion That nation after nation must spiral down a militaristic stairway into the hell of nuclear annihilation. Okay. So there you go. And Fresh she Mark came is in doing the same thing. Yeah, so vote for Melissa Myers. Yeah. Melissa Myers, Myers Orlando, you just support. <laughs> okay, say that again. I didn't hear you. Say it again. One more time. I said, Orlando, we need your support. You know what I mean? Orlando, yes, Orlando, yes. stand up. Definitely. All over Orlando, the world, Florida. all over the world. Yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. Dupree Kelly is also doing his thing too. He's running uh -huh. for council in 2022 in Newark, New Jersey, uh -huh. trying to turn that thing around as well. Because yes. when you, you got support, the statistics is very high. Mm -hmm. And we all yeah. crying for help. And if we don't do things on our own, we're never going to get the help that we actually need. That's right. Yes, we need to support these people. This is what I'm telling This is what I what I said at my event to the youth, to these um, independent artists, because you have a platform. People follow you. Mm -hmm. Facts. Um, yep. And they follow your music. They follow you. If you're performing, they're going to go. So, you know, use that platform to actually make a change in, right. in whatever neighborhood you live in, because it starts there. Facts. So Facts. I became a part of that. On the music sense, mm -hmm. I am... Um, I have so many songs that I have written, but I haven't recorded them yet. I've been so busy, but I do have Goodbye, AI, and Toxic Love um, on, on all streams. Okay. So, and I'm going to be dropping 16 bars um, mm -hmm. before Christmas. I'm going to drop 16 bars. Um, so you guys look out for that and follow me on social media, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, you know, partner with me, join my events. We do great things, you know, and, and I think that's what I want to do with the music. That's, you know, I know the music industry is like, you know, with many demonic and evil things. So, you know, yeah. trying to find a way through that. <laughs> Somehow, you know. <laughs> yeah. So, that's gotta help me. If you stay true to you, you won't be influenced by, you know, other outside stuff, you know what I mean? You just gotta say true to what you believe. So well, I respect your grizzly. Yeah. Because COVID you. didn't stop nothing for you. Mm -hmm. You've been in Atlanta, you've been in Florida, NYC, you're traveling, you're constantly on that stage. So salute to you and all the hard work that you're actually putting in. Yes, thank you for that. I appreciate that. You know, and with that said, you know, COVID being a, a, a huge pandemic that was put upon us, you know, the last two years. You know, it's all about staying he healthy, having a mental, you know, a, a healthy mental state, first and foremost, and taking care of your body. You know, mm. a lot of people are like, Angie, you, you, you know, you're out there, I'll be praying for you that you don't get sick. I said, well, I take care of my mind, body, and soul. So, you know, as long as you do that, you don't have to be afraid of a lot of things. Now, our elderly people, we need to take care of, you know, because right. it affected a lot of elderly more than, than youth. I lost some you know young men to COVID. you know that inspired mm. me to write goodbye um my song goodbye my friend meg may he rest in peace he suffered right in the beginning of when it started and you know it took him so right. i know how serious it is you know yeah uh, but a lot of people will worry about me they're like oh my god you still out there and i'm like i know because you know it's just my mindset it's just the way i am it's, it's the grind <laughs> You know, yeah, yeah no, the, this dream is not going to chase itself. 
I met great people. How did you connect with PYN, Protect Your Neck? Oh, Protect Your Neck Records. Big shout out to Mook, Mook in the Morning. You guys got to tap into that too. Uh -huh. Mook in the Morning. <laughs> Yes, um, Protect Your Neck Records. I got through to Protect Your Neck Records through Federal District Records. Um, mm -hmm. I was signed to Federal District Records last year. I, I met, well, this year actually, it would have been a year uh, next month. Mm -hmm. uh, so I got through to PYN through Federal District. Nice. Mm. Okay. And what's the deal with Federal District? Well, I'm no longer part of that label. Uh, I kind of branched off and, and you know, bloomed into my own kind of business mm -hmm. and they respected that you know they 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 love me so much as the whole group you know everybody loves me so much and they they have they do believe in my craft you right. know so you know besides the business part that you know kind of i wasn't with you know i had to branch off you know, okay. I, I love what I came, what came out of that. I met great, pe great people. Shout out to Shamika Bottoms. She was always supportive, yeah, very supportive to me. Uh, Vega Devon, very supportive. Shout out to Wu Tang Management. Uh, you know, it, it was a beautiful experience, no matter what. You know, yeah. no matter what was what came out of at the end. Uh huh. So now you just you just blossomed and you're growing your own situation is. Yeah, that works. I'm glad I had the choice. You know, some people go into situations they can't get out of. Yeah, you know? yeah, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> That's uh, okay. <laughs> so I'm, I'm, you know, I'm happy I had the choice, and I'm happy that I still have their support. You know, so yeah, that just says how great of a people they are. You know. Yeah, so I almost don't want to ask what the five-year goal is because you kind of ran it down. <laughs> you're building your business and you know what I mean? Taking off in that way. Well, what would you, you like to be in five years? years? Um, that's a good question. You know, um, I just want to be serving my purpose. You know, I want to be serving my purpose. Um, you know, of course, everybody always wants to be a little bit more financially stable. I, that's always a goal, you know. Cryptocurrency, we're, 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 we're rooting for you. <laughs> I'm telling you, we're rooting for crypto, okay? Yes, you know, yes. Um, but yes, uh, my, my goal is kind of to be more financially stable, my business be, you know, uh, more successful than what it is right now, because I wouldn't say it's, it's, it wasn't a success. My first event was a, a wonderful success. Mm -hmm. um, I was able to help 25 families with my small event. Oh, that's cool. So, yeah. 25 families are getting turkeys thanks to Melissa Myers, Legacy One Management, The Lab Orlando, and Royal Stars Entertainment. We all came together and we made it possible. Um, so we did that. So my goal is to just continue that mm -hmm. and be able to be successful at that and make that something that I do annually. Um, okay you know, and things like that. So just to grow in my business and be a little bit more financially stable than what I am now. Right. Um, and just serve my purpose in my communities. No? Okay, okay. Uh, shout out to Asian, Asiatic black man, 1877. Shout out to you. Shout out to the vintage Doyle 80. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but you know, shout out to big, Somebody dark. <laughs> Get glasses, Alex. Get glasses. I can't. It's five different. No, it's bad. No, 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 no. It don't make no sense. L I L B Y I R. It's like. <laughs> okay, I'm going to shout out. You know. <laughs> But Big now, shout out to Daryl Gibbs as well. Yeah, Roosevelt Gibbs. Pierce. Yeah. Shout out to um, everybody watching. No, no, no. Uh, <laughs> GQ is also in the building as well. Oh, uh, so. Morella, that's um, Australia. Yeah, Australia yeah, is definitely in the Australia. building right yeah, now. So that's yeah. huge. Mm -hmm. Big shout out to everybody that's tuned in, that's tapped in. Yeah. Because you yeah. could be any place else in the world, but instead you right here yep. rocking with the Mighty Mighty Wyatt So Serious TV. That's with right. energy stars up in the building. Stop. Yeah. That's what's <laughs> up. That's what's up. So, yeah. what are we going to get from you? Are we going to get an album, EP? What's, what's taking place? An uh, EP is going to be dropping, definitely. Uh, oh. My plan is to drop it before New Year's. 
Um, I'm going to hit y'all with an EP before New Year's, and then I'm going to hit y'all with the album next year for my birthday. Oh, okay. okay. That's <laughs> dope. Yeah. yeah. That's dope. So, that's who are you releasing with? Well, right now, I'm producing with Concord Studios. Shout out to Concord Studios, Goliath. Um, he's been producing my tracks. So I'll be in that studio, booked and hooked, baby. Mm, dope. Okay. Dope. Are you looking for brand new producers and stuff to collaborate with your project? Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm in Orlando and mostly in New York and Brooklyn. So Brooklyn producers, Orlando producers, Kimmy, Kissimmee, you know, if you're local to those areas, um, that's usually where I'm at. So hit me up, definitely. A Angie Stars, S T A R R Z, and come with them beats. You know, like if you was coming for Big Pun, I I need that hard shit. I need that Wu Tang shit. I need I need them bangers. You know, like I I, I know there's still hip hop fans out there that love the real gritty gritty hip hop. So come fuck with your girl, man. That's what's up. That's who's your favorite writer? Ooh. I like Neo. Neo is one of my favorite writers. Hey, say it again out of here. Neo. Neo. Like Neo. Oh, songwriter. Yeah, songwriter. Neo. Okay. Well, I like Neo. What about a uh, book writer? Oh, book writer. I have a lot of I have a lot of good book writers. I don't really have a favorite. I usually go with the books that have the poems. And those are different writers. So yeah. I, I don't have a favorite book writer. Cause there's, you know, book, books are just so amazing. Like okay. people can be so amazing in books that are better than movies. Right. So there's so more in detail. So I don't really have, a, have favorite a favorite book per se. When I was younger, I loved Goosebumps. Like oh, Goosebumps. <laughs> I see that too. That, those were my books, you know, um, I love those. And what was his name? Aro Stein. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh huh. That's what's up. I like I like the Goosebumps series. Shout out to the mm -hmm. Goosebumps series. It's Shout out to the Goosebumps. Not scary, you know. I like <laughs> I like that for the kids. Um, I was going top five. That's female, what I was waiting for. Female rapper. Top five. Dead or alive. Top five. Uh, alive. Alive. Yeah, we don't want them dead. We don't want them sleepwalking. Nah, nah. We don't want them sleepwalking. <laughs> so I really like new for 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 the new artists for me. Well, even though he's not new anymore, but Kendrick Lamar lyrically. Female. No females. You're cheating. Female. Oh, only females. Yeah. Okay. I love Remy Ma. She's my top number one. Mm -hmm. She will always be my number one. Remy Ma. I never called you a female MC. I always called you an MC. Okay. For real. Remy, oh, let me see, let me see, let me see. I, you know, I give it to Nicki Minaj because she's a good writer. Okay. And, you know, I give her credit for that. Like, she really puts in that pen work, and I appreciate her for that. So I like okay. Nicki Minaj. Yeah. I love Cardi B. She's our spicy girl. Yeah, yeah. You know, she, she put the spice in hip-hop. You know it. Everybody knows it. She brought the spicy to hip-hop, and we all love her. Yeah, even though yeah. people okay. didn't want to you know right right i rooted for her since day one okay um so cardi b she's my number three because three is my favorite number um i've been i've been listening to lady luck a lot lately okay, lady luck. Mm, okay. I've been listening to lady luck shout out to lady luck yeah shout out to lady luck um i don't want to miss anybody because i'm 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 terrible with names, guys. I know one there's more. there's a lot of good. Got one West, more to go. West Coast. Just one more. West Coast. I know there's a lot of good females out there. Yeah, West Coast. Um, a couple of them. One more. One more. <laughs> <laughs> rapper? Does she have to be a rapper? Uh, yes. She has to be a rapper. Uh huh. All right, so I'm gonna go with Bia because she's so cute. Okay. And she her flow is unique. Okay. You know. You do. Her flow is unique. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Male, males, males, males. Um, alive, Nas, mm -hmm. Jada Kiss. Shout out to Jada Kiss, dopest MC. Papoose, dopest MC. Loved, loved them. Those are my top three. Um, Jay Z, of course. 
he's iconic and um, what he has done, uh, you know, it was a huge sacrifice to, mm -hmm. to he grew up as a person. So a lot of people don't understand how hard it is to, to transition like that. Yeah. Um, to, to what he transitioned into. So, you know, I know it was a huge sacrifice. Shout out to Jay-Z. Uh, one more. He's not a line. The rest of them. Let me find out you're going to say pun. Then he's not alive, man. But all right, for alive. So I said Kendra Lamar. Have you guys heard Hobson? Hobson, I kind of like his music and I kind of don't like his music because the message okay. is more demonic than anything to me. And I'm not into that. And the only reason I, I like him is not about his music is because of his wordplay. Mm -hmm. I'm like a writer, so, I, so I'm a writer. So when I look at your, your verses or your bars, hold on. Sorry, guys. All right, y'all. It's, oh, it's 338. Let me in my camera. Say hi real quick. Say hi. Say hi. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> ow, ow, ow. <laughs> she don't want to come over here. <laughs> All right, all right, sorry, baby. Yeah, kids are out. Um, <laughs> um, the, so I'm a writer, so I, I look at it as, you know, how they wrote. Uh-huh, yeah. So I don't listen to his music. There's only like one song probably that I listen to. Yeah. But um, I've heard I've heard some things and it's the way he writes that, you know. And I know, I'm missing, I know I'm missing some people. I should have made a list, but. You rank them on lyricism. Like that's yeah. how, that's how they hit your top five. They can't. Just that's how they get to my top five. Now, Dad, of course, big pun. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm a big Stack Bundles fan. Rest in peace, yeah. Stack. Okay. I used to okay. listen to Stack Bundles and Chinks Drugs. Rest in peace to them. Mm -hmm. You know, those those were like amazing artists to me. You know, and I knew yeah, they were gonna. I think it was a gift to hip hop. To even be able to listen to both of them music, stack bundles, uh, change drugs, both yeah. of them, their music, they're going and their music still rock right now. Right. Yeah. Yeah. DMX. DMX, yeah. I was a big DMX fan. He's a lyricist and I loved how much he loved God. You know, and he always try to incorporate that no matter what. Yeah, that's so. Keep God first, whatever you do. Mm hmm. Mm. Yes, yes, indeed. Okay, it's that's why I say it. Yeah. We got Angie mm. Stars up in the building. I know, right? I can't wait to get to Orlando. Orlando, Orlando. When is Live Wires coming to Orlando? Live Wires got to yeah. take it. Yeah, yeah, we got to come down there and put the shoe on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so that's what's up. That's what's up. Yep, that's what's up. We're going to make that happen sometime. Yeah, like, share, follow, subscribe. subscribe. Angie, let them know your social media sites. Where can they reach you at and all that good stuff? Yeah, you can find me on Instagram, on Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat, or Angie Stars, S T A W -R, R Z. Just look for me. Go ahead and follow my Royal Stars Entertainment page so you can see when the events is popping, when the shows are coming, when the albums dropping. You know, that's my business page. Go support that page and, you know, support the real man. That's all I can say. That's what's up. Okay, I got one more question. Yeah, yeah. What kind of friend are you? Well, I am a loyal friend. Uh -huh. I'm the one that tells you the truth and the one that you come to when you want to know the truth. Okay. All right. Okay. She That's the friend I am. I'm the one that hugs and cries and fights for you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you no, know, you know you 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 can come to stars. <laughs> It's not a game. Good. <laughs> we out here. I believe that un unarmed truth and unconditional love will have the final word. Here for real. We out here for real. Make we sure out here for real, so come see me. Yeah, go go uh, pull up Angie Star. Which is pull up, pull up. Like I'll be at the Shrine, uh -huh. November twenty first. I'm performing at that music festival. If y'all want to see Angie Stars perform live, come through. Get your tickets and okay. let's go.
for love. Okay, boom. Oh, before we leave, we need a drop. I'm rain jack. Oh, there you go. Uh oh. Rain uh -oh. Jackson. <laughs> it's hot here. It's hot here. Uh -huh. Rain Jackson. Oh, no. Oh, okay, stop. Rain Jackson, DJ Live Wires, Live Wire Radio Show. Big, big, big hug, big love, big shout out from Angie Stars and Royal Stars Entertainment to DJ Live Wires and Rain Jackson at Radio Live Wires Radio Show, baby. Let's go. Check out all the music.